Hey everybody, Collector Cousin here, and today I'm going to weigh some Unbroken Bonds Pokemon Dollar Tree packs. I did a tutorial video on how to weigh packs from this set a while ago, be sure to check that video out. But to summarize, you want to buy packs that weigh more than 7.67 grams, and that will ensure that you at least get a reverse holo card. I have a total of 13 packs here to open up, and hopefully I get some great cards. So let's start by calibrating the scale here. If you guys want to weigh packs, the link for the scale is in the description down below. So 100 grams, pretty much right on the dot. And let's start with this Charizard pack. It weighs in at 7.74 grams. And what we get is a reverse, a reverse Caterpie. So let me put that down here and open up the next pack after I weigh it. It weighs 7.69 grams. So it just meets that threshold of more than 7.67 grams. And what we have inside is another reverse, a reverse Perugly. This pack weighs in at 7.69 grams, another lighter pack. And a reverse reds challenge. So this pack weighs in at 7.70 grams. And another reverse, a reverse curum. So I'm on a streak of reverses, 7.66 grams, and this pack has, wow, our first hit, and it's a great hit. It's a secret rare gold card, Metal Core Barrier, and you grab a sleeve for this card, and this is an awesome hit. And it only cost me $1 to get this card. Of course, in total, I spent $13 for all these packs. Hopefully you get some more ultra rares. This pack weighs in at 7.70 grams. And if you wanna do the card trick, there's a little uh, card here. They don't include this in the newer sets of Sword and Shield, but it's, um, it's kind of like a promotional card. It's not a promo card, but they advertise the the Pokemon TV app and the card game. After you remove that card, you just want to take one card from the back and this is how you do the card trick. And we just got a Licka Licky reverse. So this pack weighs in at 7.69 grams. But I usually don't do the card trick because I open up so many packs, I just get right to it. And another reverse, reverse Haunter. This pack weighs in at 7.75 grams. This pack is a little bit heavier. Hopefully you get to get another ultra rare. Nope, just a reverse energy spinner. This pack weighs in at 7.76 grams. Hopefully I can get a good card, like maybe Charizard, another rainbow, another gold card. And it's not a rainbow, it's not a gold card, but we did get a Persian GX. So let me grab a sleeve for this card. And this pack weighs in at 7.68 grams. And we have a reverse triple acceleration energy couple more packs left and we only got two ultra rares not too great 7.74 grams hopefully we get to pull one more ultra rare and we did we got Lucario and Melmetal GX okay two packs left this one weighs in at 7.81 grams a really heavy pack Hopefully you get a really good pull. Come on Charizard. 
Not a Charizard, but I did get an Ultra Rare, our Gardevoir, and Sylveon GX. Let me grab a sleeve for it. And our final pack weighs in at 7.77 grams. And we have a Salandit Reverse. So overall, I got some decent pulls. Let me recap them real quick. So in total, I opened up 13 of these Unbroken Bonds Dollar Tree Packs and I got four Ultra Rares. I got this Gardevoir and Sylveon GX, Lucario and Melmetal GX, Persian GX, and the best pull is this Gold Card Secret Rare Metal Core Barrier. So if you guys enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like button down below and subscribe to my channel for more pack weighing videos in the future. Thanks for watching guys. Collect your cousin out.